this video of a mobile home makeover, we go step through step of how to operate a Mag uh, Graco Magnum X5 paint sprayer. Deb returns and gets to work, and we have some special visitors from afar. Looks like the cat visited last night. Good dogs. So my brother and I were laughing about how all the food just looked like butt plugs, but we think we've figured out the mystery is deer. Took up his first day back. And my brother's last day, last full day here. Oh, he's in his painting gear. He's gonna be priming in here. So I, of course, did myself a very important job of setting up a hammock. Oh yeah. Yep. There we go. <sighs> I kind of wish I'd done this sooner. Day two of spraying. So to open the kills too, you break this little guy and peel off around hard to do single-handed that's garbage and then you pry each one of these up it's just can be done by hand so you want to start by having everything ready you got a bucket of water a waste bucket and your paint pretty already mixed up. Then you want to plug in the unit. Suit it up. Put this on like so. Submerge the suction tube into the pail filled with water. And put the drain tube into the waste. You want that to be up in the prime position. And then on the other side, over by the pressure knob, over here, there's a button, and you want to push that twice. Turn the pressure thing to start. Is it this way or the other way? This way. Got it. Turn the power switch on. Now, you want to make sure this is flowing for about 30 seconds. So now you're going to submerge the suction tube, the fat one, into the paint. Turn the power switch to on. Wait for paint to come out of this tube. Get this out of the way. Okay, turn it off. Sprayer, rotate that to the unclogged position. Yeah. Remember, the red is the front of the sprayer. Put the prime switch into the spray position, which is down. Number, number C. So release the trigger lock. Then turn the machine on. Now spray into the waste thing until paint, paint starts to come out. That's paint, stop. Transfer the drain tube to the paint pail and attach it to the uh, attach it to the suction tube. So with that clip right there. Okay. Now rotate the spray tip to the spray position. You're ready to go. So now you want to turn the 
pressure thing to the start position. But you're ready to start spraying. Okay. Do we, do we just keep this at start? Oh, you can, you can, I tweaked it a little bit harder than start um, yesterday, okay. but it doesn't necessarily have to. It depends on how the gun's behaving, and I think I was a little antsy. Okay. So now you start spraying, and the rule of spraying is uh, try not, is keep it going. Uh, obviously, you know, you try to make as long and fluid motions as you can. 12 inches. 12 inches and it's like if you do it overlap, you know, it overlap 50% of what you just did. Oh, there you go. Can I come in there, Brooke? Yeah. You're too close, too. 12 inches. Move along at this slow pace. I think this way you wind up with drips and stuff. Okay. And I think you need a little bit more pressure, too. And long strokes. Long strokes. I just turned up your pressure a little bit, but... Hopefully you won't get that trace line down at the bottom. So Deb just went to go get a weed whacker. Brooke is spraying and I'm fixing some of my mistakes from yesterday. I don't know how to remove the spray tip guard yet, so we're going to have to get that out. But, um, so you want to move the suction and drain into, into the water pail? Into the, no, into the waste, into the pail. waste pail. So do that right now. Yep. And, and you want to have the power off while you're doing this, apparently. Okay. Okay, now, pick one into the water, the suction tube. And you, yeah, you can see, now we've got it in prime. Now you want to turn it on for 20 seconds until water starts coming out of there rather than okay. paint. Where should this be? Should this be over the waste bucket? Over the waste bucket. <laughs> now you want to flip the C, the, the prime switch, down to spray. Okay. And put your power on. And spray into the paint bucket until it stops being paint coming out. Okay, I'm not sure if it's in locked position right now, is it? Yeah, you want to unlock it. Spray into here. And spray down into it. That's getting close to water. So you might start, spray, start spraying into a waste. And you can check again, see if it's still spraying paint or if it's spraying water. Water. Okay, so try uh, flipping the nozzle as well the other way to the um, unclog. Watch where and wipe, everything off. wipe down the spray nozzle. Wipe down the wipe down down the suction nozzle. Wipe down the exhaust nozzle. All that stuff as good oh. as you can. Wipe down the machine as good as you can. It's all water based, so I'm gonna get this wet. Well, you can use the water right there to get it wet. Yeah, just don't like goal for today is to paint the final colors here in the kitchen and living room. What we notice after painting primer is that there's about 10 million little holes that need to still get filled. It's happening out here, babe. It's just hot. Anything else? Oh, you're... It's huge, too. You made it all, in terms of a spay end, it's kind of huge, yeah, huh? Poor cat's wondering what on earth just happened. Hey, babe. What was that? It's 
going on in here? Budget. Another coat of paint down. It's starting to look like something. And another, another layer of O oh, the main wall color, which is eggshell. And then in the kitchen, we're using the semi-gloss, and I definitely see opportunities to uh, hit some spots, like over here in the utility room. It's a little dicey. But it's coming along, and apparently I've got the same mark of paint on my face as yesterday. With painting, there comes waste, uh, waste water and clean water. So I'm um, using, reusing this ditch here. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to record. All right, this is our little family reunion. It's free. Oh, nice, Blake. Remember this race? <laughs> is that in a movie? Uh -oh. Yeah, it was a Bond movie. Thanks for watching. The next videos might be a little slow coming over the next few days. Going to spend a little time just hanging out. Uh, remember to like and subscribe.